an American business magnate and former presidential candidate, Ross Perot, had sold his company, Electronic Data Systems, to General Motors in 1984 for $2.6 billion. As a part of the deal, he became the largest single GM shareholder and garnered a seat on the board. In short order, he became terribly frustrated and did not hesitate to speak out about what he termed GM's bloated bureaucracy. He was incredulous at the amount of time GM would spend to make what to him were simple decisions. Some commentators said that the motto at EDS was ready, fire, aim while at GM, it was ready, aim, aim, aim. The sense being that GM was unable to pull the trigger. One of the key reasons for the purchase of EDS by GM was a desire on the part of the auto giant to revitalize itself. The company had become stagnated and was slow to embrace new technology. He was once quoted as saying, I come from an environment where, if you see a snake, you kill it. At GM, if you see a snake, the first thing you do is to hire a consultant on snakes. Then you get a committee on snakes, and then you discuss it for a couple of years. The most likely course of action is nothing. You figure, the snake hasn't bitten anybody yet, so you just let it crawl around on the factory floor. We need to build an environment where the first guy who sees the snake kills it. And he left these famous quotes. If you see a snake, just kill it, don't appoint a committee on snakes. As someone who had built his own company from the ground up, and trained his employees from day one to prioritize excellent customer service, Perot was in for a shock at GM. His quote on snakes describes that shock well. Underperforming organizations spend more time reviewing than executing. When these organizations are faced with a problem, they don't go straight into execution, but they review and review what is good and whether it's really the perfect solution. What about your organization?